Hi, I'm the main Jaybird. I made this video to show you how I was able to play Reasons, uh, Scales, and Chords Player with Random LFO. This would have some utility in making generative music. Also, maybe you could use something like this to practice to. You could have it throw you chords, and you could try to guess what they were, or you could watch it and then just try to play your scales as it's changing. You can set it to constant key or a constant scale. Uh, my results aren't particularly musical. This is more for a proof of concept to show you how to do it if you want to take it in a direction that matters to you. So let me show you. I've got two Pulsar machines here. This first Pulsar machine I have running into a Thor step sequencer. One LFO goes to rate in and one goes to pitch in. So it's picking random notes and then it's playing them at a random rhythm. And then the sequencer, the note and gate of that is sent to the in of the combinator. So this Thor doesn't make any noise. It just plays the combinator. And so then the combinator routes that through the scales and chords. Now this Pulsar machine, LFO1 goes into Rotary1, LFO2 into Rotary2, and then you use the programmer, this where it says default, that's the player. Rotary1 is picking the key, and the range is the full range. And Rotary 2 is picking the scale. And I've set that to the full range, excluding custom and chromatic, uh, just because I chose it that way. The trick with this is getting your levels right. If you set them too high, it pins the LFO more to the top and bottom of the list. And if you set the level too low, then it will only select from the center of the list and never reach the outliers. Um, and so every eight bars, it'll pick a new key and every four bars, it'll pick a new scale. And, uh, so I'll just play it and you can see what it does. <laughs> So that's how it works, and I'll give you a download to this patch. And I'll also give you this one. Um, it didn't work quite right because I had a problem with the levels, like I was telling you. Uh, but in some ways, it's a little more musical. I thought it was interesting, so I just figured I'd throw it in. I'll let you hear that for a second. This one doesn't go outside of the range of... So that's it. Thanks for watching. Have fun.